that there are three narrations or there are three historical opinions as to where the grave of Sayyidah Zahra may possibly be. Having said this, nobody knows for sure where this grave is. And perhaps this is going to be a reality that is made public for us upon the duhur of the Imam. But the question is, why is this grave unknown? Why is the grave of Sayyidah Zahra unknown? The answer for this, Ya Ahibba'i, is that Sayyidah Zahra herself willed for the grave to be unknown. And let me read for you a part of her wasiyah by text, because this is in way of proof of establishing this. This is mentioned in Kitab Misbahul Anwar, and you have the hadith around the same effect narrated in Kitab Al Kafi of Sheikh Al Kulaini Rahmatullah Alayhi and in the Amali of Sheikh Al Saduk, where Sayyidah Zahra says to Amirul Mu'mineen, Usika an la yashhad ahadun janazati min haula illadina zalamuni wa akhadu min haqqi. My wasiya to you, Ya Ali, is that. Those people who oppressed me, who did zulm on me, and those people who took my haq, my inheritance, my right away from me, not a single one of them should be allowed to be present at my janazah. Haji, this is Sayyidah Zahra, whose hujjiyya is over the hujjiyya of the Anbiya, as we said yesterday. Look what she says. فَإِنَّهُمْ عَدُوِّي وَعَدُوا رَسُولَ اللَّهِ Indeed, they are my enemies and the enemies of Rasulullah. وَلَا يُصَلِّ عَلَيِّ أَحَدٌ مِّنْهُمْ وَلَا مِنْ أَتْبَائِهِمْ I do not want any one of them to pray on me, to pray over my janazah. I do not want any one of their followers to be present in my janazah. وَادْفِنِّي فِي اللَّيْلِ إِذَا حَدَأَتِ الْأُيُونِ وَنَامَتِ الْأَبْصَارِ And I want you, Ya Ali, to bury me in the darkness of the nights when the eyes have gone to sleep, when the people have gone to sleep. For we understand from this wasiya of Sayyidat Nisa'il Alameen that she willed for her grave to be unknown for her grave to be majhul such that it can be a form of protest against the zulm that happened after the martyrdom of Rasulullah until Yawmul Qiyamah from the time of her istishhad until Yawmul Qiyamah any person born a Muslim when he goes to Mecca or to Medina to perform the Hajj or the Ziyarah of Rasulullah he will look to the east and look to the west and say where is the grave of the only daughter of Fatima and no one will have any answer except to say that she was madluma and she willed that no one knows where her grave is because the haqq of Ali was taken. Allahumma salli ala Muhammad wa ala Muhammad. This is a protest, the only daughter of Rasulullah. This Fatima who is Sayyidat Nisa al Alameen. Where is she buried? Where is she buried? And therefore, the grave being majhul. The location being unknown is a form of protest on the madlumiyah of Amir al and the madlumiyah of Ahlul Bayt in general. So therefore, the fact that the grave is unknown doesn't mean the tragedy didn't happen on her. Rather, it is a greater proof that she was oppressed and unhappy with the companions of Rasulullah.